Yeah! What up, y'all? And welcome back to another one. We are here, out here again, dove hunting. We got old Frederick. Set. Set. The last dove hunt, he did really, really, really well. I'm having to keep him on a leash, um, but keeps him from breaking. Keeps him safe. And it's teaching him not to break, obviously to stay until told to go retrieve that down bird. So it's been great. Today's gonna be a little bit different. We got some pigeon decoys out. We got a lot of spinning action going on. We got like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. A lot of spinning going on out here. We got the panel blind out here. We got the boys, we got old Bradley, Ross, Jordan, and old Zella. What are you doing in town? You're not supposed to be here. I know, just living the dream here. Yeah, he's for, he moved to old Arkansas, left us in the dust. I did. I and now did. he thinks he just gets to show up and hunt when he wants. <laughs> but check out the new Ducks gear we got. We got long sleeves, we got the new camo hats. They're all available on the website. A lot of other stuff as well. All new products, everything. Shirts, hoodies, you name it, it's on there. I will link all of it down in the description below. Go check it out. You guys know when you guys purchase something, it goes directly to supporting your boy and helping me bring you guys more of these videos. But we're gonna get old Frederick on the leash. Hopefully he'll stay decently today. We got the old panel, and we got the old camo net behind us. We're all gonna be packed in here like sardines. Kinda already look like a sardine, Ross. Pretty much. <laughs> I think it'll probably, I think it's four baby humans, but it works for baby Is it bugs. baby? Family care. You Family got the good care. stuff. Yeah. It's the dry stuff, you know. <laughs> oh, there's the first shot, boy. I'm going to die before oh, I oh, even get a shot off. <laughs> this is literally going to drive me nuts, this many, this many mosquitoes, dude. Oh, we got to Shoot him, boy. Oh, he's down. I think that was all you. Look at Frederick. He's on it like a bonnet. Here. Dead bird. Pick it up. Dead bird. Dead bird. Here. Heel. Good boy. It's banded! I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. That, that would be pretty gnarly, wouldn't it? Good boy, Frederick. You need to hold that bird in your mouth, okay? How can I get that through to you rather than going complete force fetch on you that's a good boy good boy fred he's on it today dead bird come on good boy dude dead bird dead bird here we'd have so much more heal good boy that's a good boy here look get a drink here look Right sit. <laughs> I'm not sending him. He he can sit for a while. He is not listening very well. You better sit, dude. Gonna have to get a collar on him badly. Very, very badly. Like now. Should've already had one on him. Sit. He, kicked, oh, he, <laughs> he turned this one for us. He's uh he's not totally gone yet. Ducks. Ross, hit your uh, dove call real quick. Dove call? Yep. I, I couldn't even hear it. How's the birds <laughs> gonna hear that? <laughs> On the right side, right side. Oh, Zilla with the no. You're not gonna try, it, huh? No. You don't like those 70 yarders, huh? Here, here, here. Fred, here. Nope. Fred, dead bird. Come on, buddy. Fred, here. Come on, my bird. Good. Heel. Who does that? Uh, that wasn't mine. Uh, Fred here. Set. No, I don't want Set. <laughs> Set. Man, these birds really come in waves. It's like it'll be dead and then 10 are right in your face. <laughs> I think someone got the Good job. He broke, but he broke after everybody's done shooting. Dead bird. Good. Here. He, Uh-oh. Got out of his mouth. Someone shoot him. I hit him. <laughs> Here. Pretty sure he just got tired. Here. I know I didn't hit dead him. bird. Fred, dead bird. Dead bird. He went through the flock of flickers, man. These flock of flickers are messing him up. He sees them and he goes to them. Fred here. Heel. Heel. Sit. Dead bird. Fred. 
working Fred. It's been a uh, learning experience these last two days of Dove. I'm telling you what, he has, uh, he's done good. Here, good boy, good boy. Here, my bird, my bird. Good boy. Now there's another one over here, come on, Fred. Good, there he goes, he got it that time. Good, come on Fred, good, here. Dog, here, nope, dead bird, dead bird, dead bird. Good, here, come on, here, let's go. My bird, heel. Good boy, that's a good boy. Dog. Dead bird. Good, here. Let's go. Here, Fred. Fred, here, here, here. My bird. Good boy. That was a good retrieve. You need to stop. He's pulling the, pulling this out from under my foot. You need to sit, dude. Sit. Fred. Good. Here. Let's go. Let's go. Frederick, I don't know what we're going to do with you. He'll do good. He'll do good and then it's like he just gives up on life or something. I don't I don't know. My GoPro is dead, so I forgot to charge it from yesterday. So, there are some pigeons showing up. We've shot about six pigeons. How many dove we got down total, you think? I think we got 20 yeah, down 20 or so. Down. Probably 20. Uh, Ross, how many you got? About six. Brad, yeah, you got like five. five. Zilla's got five. So yeah, I'm sure 20 all together. Uh, the old goggles are just fogging up out here. Something fierce. The uh, the humidity is, is going up on us. But this guy here, it's going to be time for a shot caller. Got to do it, man. He's just, he'll start wandering. Like it's it's like he gets worn out. Uh, I, I know the motion, the flock of flickers are kind of bothering him. He'll go pick up a bird, put it in his mouth, and then a flock of flicker or another bird will steal his attention. And uh, yeah, it's kind of just downhill from there. I have to keep hollering, dead bird, dead bird, and, and make him bring me one. There's been many times where he goes, picks one up, and then he sees another one, so he drops it, and then he gets distracted again from a flock of flicker, and now he just doesn't want to have that you went Fred. yep he got that one good deal so we're out here still spraying and praying uh doves are starting to roll in some more pigs so i'll try to film what i can with the big camera um but it's a little hard you know i do want i do want to shoot come on let's go here friend good boy that's a guy thank you now he's holding it at least though every now and then he'll hold it in his mouth Hey Fred, come here, get a drink. Get a drink, buddy. Get you a good old drink. That's a good boy. Tell you what though, this is good hunting for him. This is good old training before duck season gets here. George. What gun you got there, fella? Still using the old humpback? The OA5, brother. What did you used to use, an SX3? Uh, Versamax. Oh, a Versamax. Yep. You kind of done with the Versamax or what? No, no, just like to bring the old girl out. Sometimes. Just like bringing the old girl out at the beginning of the season. What are you running today, Rossi? A little M2. A little M2 action. Are you liking it? Today, yeah. You liking Very it? So. Better than the new Black Eagle? Super Black Eagle 3, yeah, SB3. Don't, don't buy one. Yeah, bro. Very bad. Ross don't like them. Very unfortunate. He just don't like them. What happened to yours? You ballooned the barrel because you put a very, yeah. very restricted full choke on it and then yeah. you shot T shot that out of an extra fault. full. The gun not cycling. That is was not, not Benelli's fault. fault, Ross. That was my fault. The gun not cycling. Good was not night. My fault. Out of the box. If anybody from Benelli's watching this, Fuck don't me. mind my friend here. Don't mind my friend here. What are you, uh, now that he's done complaining, yeah. what are you shooting, Mattzilla? The SB2. Oh, is that a new one? Did you buy a new I one? I got it last year. Oh, you did? It looks. Yeah. Looks like you haven't even used her. Well, you don't ever invite me to come up, so I can't. Well, you moved a state away, or four or five states, yeah, however yeah, far, you know. Yeah. All right, what are you rocking today? Oh, uh, got the old the, SB2 out, huh? The cheaper SB2. Yep. That's 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 Jordan's lovely little friend there. All beat up, but she's mine, and we understand. <laughs> come on, buddy. Are you worn out or what, huh? 
two days in a row, old Frederick's been out dove hunting. He's worn out. Yesterday, when we got home, uh, <laughs> he literally laid down and didn't move for like two or three hours. So I'm sure he's gonna do it for about four or five hours today. Won't even move, I guarantee it. It's good for him though. So yesterday, uh, which was dove opener, it was just me, myself, and I shooting. And Fred really enjoyed that. We worked well together as a pair. Here, Fred. Today, we had four more guns in the blind, pretty much. So um, it was a little different for him to get used to, but with me having him on that leash, making him stay uh, and not break, he broke a couple times. He yanked it out from under my foot. Uh, but I'm, he's not doing bad. He's not doing bad with the whole leash system. And uh, I think it's better using it. A lot of you have said, Bobby, tie him down. Uh, he's gonna be breaking. If you don't, you need to do it now. I thank you guys so much for giving me those, uh, those pointers and those tips about tying him down on a leash, not letting him break. So then you can send him after the gunfire is all over. A, it's a lot safer for him, so he don't possibly get shot from breaking. And two, it's just teaching them obedience. I don't want them breaking, you know, let's say someone stands up to go shoot. We end up not taking the birds because they want to circle again. And now he's out in the field. Lots of reasons why, but I got to say thank you guys so much for always helping me. Dropping your comments down in the comment section. Telling me, Bobby, you need to do this. You need to do that. Fred's a hunting dog. And that's what he's going to be. He's going to be a good old hunting dog. Sit. 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 Let the, we gotta let the vehicle go by, dude. Come on, let's go. He's doing good though. I'm proud of him, really proud of him. And yeah, it sucks the old GoPro shut down on me, completely went. I didn't charge it after yesterday's hunt. We killed some pigs, not very many. This is the same field that we hunted yesterday, so it is what it is type of deal, you know? Come on, Fred. Good boy. That's a good boy. I'm proud of you, man. That's a good boy. He's doing awesome, man. Having Frederick here for this, this whole hunting season adds a bunch. You know what I'm saying? It adds a bunch, especially for me. I already have to juggle a camera and a gun and a call and decoys and all that. And I know, it's extra work. Extra work juggling Flair. Flair. Extra work juggling Fred. But at the end of the day, it's so rewarding getting to watch your young dog work. Well, we are back home, all washed up. Man, it was a humid morning, let me tell you what. I have been letting my old dove breasts here marinate though. Look at that. I love me some zesty Italian dressing. I'm telling you what, if you've never ate chicken marinated in Italian dressing, you need to try it. Dove marinated in Italian dressing is even better. So what we're gonna be doing today, guys, ending the video with a little bit of cooking. These have been in here for, I don't know, six hours or so or more. I got me a bag of bamboo kebab skewers, a red onion, a green bell pepper, and there we go. I'm gonna prep all this stuff, get it all ready, make me a few kebabs, one or two maybe. I'm hungry. I just need some lunch. It's just going to be me eating, so I'm not going to cook all of them. I'm going to save a little bit of them here. But I'm going to get them ready, and then I'll show you when they're all prepped ready and when the grill's hot and ready to go. So, on your onions, tip number one, don't slice them. Don't cut them, because, because you'll end up with this. you got to peel them by hand. Break them apart and peel them, so you get nice big layers like this. So then when you put them on your kebab, they look real awesome like that. If you slice them, it just don't work out good. But I got two kebabs ready to go. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight breasts on their total. That's only four birds, two kebabs. I'm a big, big kebab skewer guy. I love shrimp skewers, I love chicken skewers, I love veggie skewers, yummy stuff, guys. So, if you haven't tried dove kebabs yet, you don't have to use Italian dressing. You can use whatever you want. Give it a try. Well, the grill is ready right before we go out there. I'm gonna put a little bit of garlic salt up on these veggies. Oh, she hot, boy. She is hot. Oh, man, I love me some kebabs. Seriously, one of my favorites. 
I'm gonna set them directly on the grill there. Oh yes, oh yes, look at that. Probably gonna let that grill on, I don't know, probably four minutes, four minutes, should be done in about 10 minutes. Never, never overcook your wild game. You don't want it tough. If you cook it to where it's basically well done, if you cook it past medium, anything. I never cook anything. Dove, duck, especially duck, especially goose, um, them good old speckle bellies. Never cook it past medium, y'all. All right, let's give her a look here. Ooh, they're looking good. Getting that golden brown edge just a little bit. Taking them a bit longer to cook than I figured just because the veggies make the meat set up off of that grate. So, an extra five minutes don't hurt. Well, here we go. Look at that. Oh boy, I can already tell you it's going to be amazing. Right off the bat, I'm just going to grab it just like this. Big old chunk of bell pepper and a breast. Oh man, that's amazing. Mm. The veggie with that Italian marinade in that dove. Dove breasts are already good as they are, you know what I mean? You can basically just cook them like steak, throw some seasoning on them and you're good to go. But if you guys do want to try something different, if you have never marinated them in Italian dressing, you need to try it. It is a game changer. They are so, so good. Oh, I'm not going to be a perfect lunch. Oh my goodness. Woo! But, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I know the hunting wasn't insane. I didn't shoot my limit. But I hope you guys are liking the little mixture of me shooting and working Fred. I want to make Fred a part of the video. You all love him literally just as much as I do, so I always want to make him part of the video, especially when we're out hunting. It's going to be about Fred a little bit, you know? You guys come here for Fred, not me. I know. But thank you all for being here. If you like this video, like I said, smash that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you haven't. Hunting all season long. Four, five, six videos a week. So, turn on that notification bell like I said earlier. But until next time, peace. I've been getting laid back, baby. You should know that I don't need your criticism, pessimism. I've been keeping it on the DL. Got a girl.